Child Abuse Awareness Month comes to a close, a candlelight memorial tonight. Hope to spark change in the big country and beyond. KTAB's Mercedes Hernandez was at tonight's vigil and has tonight's top story. Mercedes? Thank you, Bob and Stacy. The vigil was an impressive showing in support, but what organizers really hoped to inspire was awareness about abuse, enough to last well beyond the month of April. This moment of silence is for them. The them? Children whose young lives were cut short. Unfortunately, last year in Texas alone, 211 children lost their lives due to abuse or neglect, including one here in Taylor County. But they're not being forgotten. It's great to be here to honor them and say, yes, we're going to fight to end child abuse. This group, led by the Taylor County Child Welfare Board, taking steps toward change. There is absolutely hope, and I'm looking at it. Because every one of us, at some level, engage these families probably on a daily basis. Helping children in need by pointing advocates toward a solution. People that bought our yard signs in the community that have the abuse hotline, that's just impactful. You know, maybe somebody that thought maybe they needed to report something saw that number and did it. And lighting the way to healing. A close friend once told me that children are resilient, that their bodies can heal much faster sometimes than adults. But what about their hearts, Lord? Earlier this month, the board made a display using donated shoes on the steps of the courthouse, symbolizing children taken from abusive homes in the county. More than 600 pairs were, of shoes were collected and will be made available to homeless students at Abilene ISD and children going through the foster care system. With coverage you can count on, Mercedes Hernandez, KTEB News. Back to you. All right, thank you, Mercedes. Abuse or neglect can be reported by calling the Texas Child Welfare Hotline. That number is 1-800-252-5400.